welcome to Friday morning or almost well pretty much Friday afternoon actually um, we've actually been up doing some bits and being super productive this morning feeling really really good since I had a bit of a meltdown the other day and was like I've got too much to do and not enough time to do it um, feeling really productive we got up we had coffees and we started doing things sent loads of things back to ASOS sent a couple of returns back to Netta Porte and Louise Via Roma so I've done all that kind of like courier stuff and getting those things delivered I've just been tidying up the place, I've been doing emails, so feeling really, really good today. So I also thought I would show you a few products that I picked up yesterday when I went to Gleam and emptied out my PO box. So a few things that I got from different brands. So these are things that I brought home that I'm super excited about. Um, Galan sent me a gorgeous little package actually of this uh, Mon Galan body lotion shower gel, also a beautifully um, embossed version with Victoria on it. This perfume smells incredible. It's honestly one of my favourites recently. And they also sent me a beautiful little passport holder as well with VM on it. Such a beautiful little gift. I got some lovely little treats from Laura Mercier. Their translucent powder is an absolute favourite so that's exciting. And as well as their brand new Flawless Fusion ultra long layer foundation so I'm going to try that today actually and see what it's like. By Terry sent me loads of really exciting things, concealers and contour sticks that they've just come out with as well as these which are gorgeous. Um, this really pretty bronzer and this blush which is just so me so again I might try those today. Benefit have just come out with these cool foolproof brow powders where it's almost like a lighter shade to a darker shade which is a bit like how you're meant to do your brows apparently so looking forward to trying those might give those a little whirl clarins have come out with a cushion foundation and i'm very very excited about it actually they sent me two shades here to try 103 and 105 so again i kind of really want to try them today and we'll see nude sticks sent me a gorgeous little package of highlighter contour stick and in here are like eyeshadows and lip products and concealers and yeah, really love this brand actually. Dior sent me their new Dior Rouge collection of lipsticks. Um, the lipstick shade and then another shade in the centre of them. So, let me show you another example. So like this really deep one with more of a pink to the centre. So I can't wait to try those. As well as these look absolutely insane. I tried one on yesterday on the back of my hand. This shade is absolutely stunning, so I'm definitely going to try this today. Um, this is shade 162 Dior Liquids. Amazing. Very, very exciting. I got the gorgeous new Balmain collection with L'Oreal Paddy. This is the first time I've even seen them. I just haven't been able to go into Gleam and pick up my PO box recently, but I think they've been sat there waiting for me. So I'm really excited to find my favourite shades in those. I've got a new Dior Hydro Life Jelly Sleeping Mask, which is like my absolute favourite nighttime cream these days. By the way, sorry about the washing machine going, it's rather loud. I've got some new replica uh, Beach Walk, which is one of my all-time favourite scents. It literally smells like holidays and walk along the beach, it's incredible. Givenchy Le Temporel Nuit um, All Night Soft Cream. These are absolutely beautiful. Iconic London sent me all of their brushes as well as their new lashes. Aveda Texture Tonic sounded awesome, so I'm very, very excited to try this in my hair. GHD, look how beautiful. This is GHD, so kindly sent me their brand new pink straighteners, like a coral pink. And I'm pretty sure that some of the proceeds also go towards breast cancer uh, research as well, which is incredible. Oh, and I also got some bits from 111 Skin. I met the lovely owners of this brand actually on a train recently and they were so lovely. Um, and they sent me some of their products to try. Cleanser, serum and also the Hydro Gel. Oh, and Sensei. Flawless Satin Foundation from Sensei and also Glowing Base. Um, that was a bit long-winded, wasn't it? Oh, actually, two more things. Two more things I haven't told you about that I put in here. That washing machine's so loud. I was also sent the little book of Huga as well. As well as a little book of, is it Likey? Or Leak? Likey? I'm not sure. So I'm looking forward to reading them. So I've got them out as like coffee table books. Oh, love them, love them, love them. By the way, how oh, cute is my little chest of drawers. It's so retro. I'm in love with it. I'll leave a link down below where you can get it. It's just so unique. Like no one else will have one of these. <sighs> Order of today. Alex has nipped out with all the post. I need to film a video for Sunday. I need to pack for New York tomorrow, yes, 
and uh, yeah, I've just got a lot of work to be doing, so <laughs> I'll check in with you in a tad. Okay, it's about an hour later, it isn't just the same time. Um, just had the most exciting parcels delivered. It's like an extremely exciting parcel day today. First off for my trip. Tomorrow I'm going to New York Fashion Week with Victoria Beckham, Estee Lauder. If you've been following me for a while, you'll have seen it on the blog and also, did I vlog it? We'll have seen it on the blog and Instagram that last season I got to go to the Victoria Beckham show in New York. And this time I've been invited again by the Estee Lauder team with VB. So they've just sent me a lovely care package again with a few little flight essentials in it and my itinerary for tomorrow and so exciting. But then, but then, but then, but then, I just got an insane delivery from Manolo Bonnick who have just sent me two new pairs of shoes that of course I'm going to take to New York Fashion Week. These are the first. Oh my goodness. These are incredible. Look how crazy that heel is. And it's like velvet, and like a deep, um, rich like burgundy velvet and then a blush kind of pink. Oh my goodness. And then these. Let me put this on the other foot so that you can see. Honestly, have you seen anything that's this cute? And in fact, these are my first ever pair of Manolos. I've always wanted to buy, I've always wanted to buy a pair of Manolos and never been able to like settle on what colour to buy, so I've never bought any. So they sent me them as a little gift and I'm absolutely thrilled. So thank you so much to Manolo. This fabric though. Oh, look, those colours though and that cool heel. Okay, I've just realised that there's another pair of shoes that I haven't shown you yet. Let me take you to the closet. Uh, where are they? These. These, these, these. So these are an incredible forest green and then look at that heel. Pointy toe, suede. Oh, so me. I'll leave a link down below. Of course. I still need to do a closet tour in here. If you want to see a closet tour where I kind of go through everything in here and kind of show you a bit more of how this closet is kind of working let me know in the comments and i will i'll do one this is going to be quite a long video just let me know lunch is served alex has made some lunch that's the one thing about this house we don't have a dining room table so we've kind of got used to now like sitting on the floor together or sitting on this table or if any of you guys have this issue where you have a flat and not enough room for a dining room or dining room table but you found a way around it in terms of how you eat, like whether it's like a cool table that you use or whether it's a really good like mat that you put across your knee or anything, let me know because we need something that's small that we can kind of keep and eat on our laps with. What is this babe? Uh, I think it's avocado and um, bean. Edam 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 oh is it? Avocado and bean? Edamai. Vegan. Yum. So I, uh, I, I've overloaded my uh, my closet with stuff and I ran out of hangers so I've just bought a load of new hangers from Amazon they're like what was it 30, 13 pounds for like 30 awesome so I thought I'd bring you into here to watch me hang up all my clothes pretty much pretty Ted Baker dress the jacket knit into my knitwear section Because we were talking about all these different products earlier, I thought like I'd put them on my face and I'm just trying out the Laura Mercier Flawless Fusion Ultra Longwear Foundation in the shade Macadamia and it's actually really really nice. It looks super supernatural. Whenever I say the word supernatural it just sounds silly because obviously supernatural is an actual word. It looks really natural on the skin but also quite covering. Okay, so liking that so far. Gonna give it another go, but I must admit I really want to give these Clarins cushions a try. So let's go with one of five nude. Like this, it opens. Ooh. Okay, so I'm just gonna pat a bit of this in. 
and it's looking quite dewy and glowy actually it's really leaving lots of moisture on my face okay right let's try this is another one of those like try show and tell days the by terry contour and concealer sticks it would seem here what's this one three i've got one two and three let's go for two looks like this you pop it up like that that's quite creamy actually Blends out nicely too. Six different contour shades. This one is 15. Quite an orangey tone though for a contour. Might be nice on the eyes though. We try blending this, it might get better. It really blend nicely. Can you see how kind of that orangey tone that is though? It's not even slightly ashy, it's definitely more of a bronzer shade. I mean, our skin is looking pretty amazing. Can you see it? Like, the radiance from that foundation is amazing. Now then, I want to try this out on camera as well. So this is the new sticks Twilight. Uh, where is it? Oh no, it's at the top of this. Oh. Here it is. Okay, right, let's try and smoosh this back in. Okay, let's try this out then. So it add a little bit more to all the consistency and it blends really, really nicely actually. Okay, I really wanna try out this blusher, Sun Desire number seven. With By Terry in Mocha Fizz. Pigmentation on them is really, really great. Oh, okay. Let's try this out. It's the Victoria Beckham Aura Gloss. Oh, I'm so excited. Okay, so this little pot of glowy goodness. I'm going to add it onto my... Oh my gosh. Oh, yes, yeah, so this is in 162. It's almost like a semi-sheer coral pink. So I got a little bit impatient and figured I wanted to see what the colours were like of this collection. So I'll show you a little sneak peek. A blue, a purple, a brown and like a grey brown. In the greens, these are more kind of like foresty shades. And then in the blacks, we have a quite rusted red. It's got very orangey tones to it. There is a purple a shimmery nude which is called confidence and this is also lovely like a like a blush quite a blushy pink well good morning guys saturday morning and we're off to new york today you're in a good mood so excited about this trip good morning how ginger my beard looks Ooh. in the plane nice and cozy got my feet and going backwards okay cozy got my laptop i got my film got a lot Let's just say, I bought all of the snacks. <laughs> a lot of snacks. We made it. This looks nice. Oh, is it nice? Oh, it is. It's so like New York y. Oh, this is so cute, isn't it? Just like. I love it when it's like this. Just really. Just minimal. But minimal it's really like, minimal. No. I like it. I really like it here. This is so nice. This marble. Think. Clean the only and thing that really minimal. Really sucks about hotel rooms in New York is, is that it's very rare that you get an amazing view. Yeah, you don't, do you? No. Oh, nice view. <laughs> oh. There's <laughs> <laughs> glass. There's glass there. <laughs> oh, full face and makeup back on. Feel like myself again. And yeah, we're just going to go out for some nice dinner before we sort of retire, really. Quite an early morning tomorrow. But no doubt we'll be waking up really early anyway. I usually wake up about five whenever I come to New York, which is perfect because it's about the time I need to be getting up anyway for tomorrow because I've got a very, very early start. Yeah, I'm going to head out now and um, I'm not too sure where we're going. In fact, where are we going? 
the flower shop. Okay, so let's come to the flower shop. Super lovely, like chill vibe in here. Really, really nice. A really cute small menu. So it's really easy to choose from. It's like everything on the menu. So I'm just gonna sell some fried chicken and fries. There's no and chicken. We, and we're all having like a little little dippy bit. Oh, that's really hot. <laughs> I've like, burnt my tongue. Yeah. So um. And that's garlic mayo, by the way. Nice. And I'm having a gin. Little gin. What would you think of the gin? Very, very strong gin. <laughs> Alex is just getting really hungry and wondering where he's it's drinking from. <laughs> it's literally a family bucket of chip fried chicken. It literally smells. Does it smell good? Insane. Does it? It smells so good. <laughs> <laughs> very sauce it too. Oh, back in the hotel, back in the room. Um, everyone just said goodbye and then the, uh, the ladies from Estee Lauder just came round with yet another bag. Like guys, what have you given me? So I thought I'd do like a little unbagging on camera. Unbagging. <laughs> unbagging. <laughs> little unbagging. See what is in this bag. Oh my gosh, it feels. What is? Oh my god, what is this? Oh my god. Inside, so inside it I've got the bronzer, I've got the lip gloss, oh, it's like a gold shimmer. I've got the eye kajal in black saffron and vanilla, I don't think I've got the black one yet. Yes, this is the black. Oh, it's the most creamy eyeliner. And the lipstick. This has only just come in, it's literally been like delayed. Like hardly anyone has this lipstick yet. How cute that little packaging is. Uh, it's like a brown tone nude. Oh my goodness, that's so exciting. This is insane, I can't actually believe this. So I quickly googled, just for you guys, to see where you can get this bag. And you can get it in a whole set, so you can buy this from Selfridges with loads of products inside it. And it's your own like Victoria Beckham makeup bag. Oh, amazing. What a gift though. Well, that's exciting. Thank you so much to Estee Lauder for an incredible gift. 